Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we are going to fix this file type is not supported in protected view on Microsoft Excel. Before moving on to the video, please don't forget to hit the subscribe and like button. So the first solution is solution first config file block settings. Click on home button, then search Excel. Then go to options, then go to trust center, then click on trust center settings, then click on file block setting on the left. Then uncheck all the boxes that have been selected. After unchecking all the boxes, click on OK. OK. Now restart your computer and check if the problem is solved or not. If not, moving on to the next solution. Solution 2. Disable protected view settings. To do this, first open Excel, then click on options, then click on trust center, then click on trust center settings, then navigate the file block settings. Then uncheck all the boxes and click OK. Solution 3. Repair Microsoft Office. If none of the above solution work, you can try repairing Microsoft Office. To do that, follow these steps. Close all the Office application. Then go to Control Panel. Click on Home button. Then search Control Panel. Then click on program and features. If that option isn't showing, click on large icon to category on the right top of the view by button. Then click on programs and feature. Programs and feature. Then go to control panel. Then search Microsoft Office. Microsoft Office Home and Student, this is my, then click on right click on it, then change, give the necessary permissions. Just like that, quick repair or online repair, first click on quick repair, if that doesn't solve the issue, then go to online repair and check if the issue is solved or not. Solution 4. Change the file name and type. Another solution that you can try to change the file name and type. You can rename the file by right clicking on it. Right click on the file, then rename, then rename the last four before dot and change it to xlsx and open the file. This will solve the problem. Solution 5. Contact Microsoft Support Team. After you have tried all these solutions, give a verb and still not you get any, any result, contact the Microsoft Support Team. I will provide you the link of Microsoft Support Team so you can contact them for further assistance. They can provide you with specific information that help you troubleshoot the problem. So that's for today guys. I hope you like the video. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe and like button and also do hit the subscribe.